Hello my family members, today we are going to solve another coding question that was asked on Accenture on campus 30 August 2023. So 24 batch, kindly be concentrated here. So the question is about string manipulation. So the question is you are given a string str consisting of low case English alphabets only and integer k. Your task is to arrange first k alphabets in increasing order, then k alphabets in decreasing order, and so on. According to the following pattern, this is the pattern to be followed, right? And print the resultant string. Note that the pattern that needs to be followed to arrange the elements in increasing and decreasing order, this is not as usual. This is from A to Z, but not as usual. It uh, actually differs from uh, from GHS from here this is actually different right arrangement of A to Z is different in this case pattern right so consider that input format is the input consists of two lines and the first line contains a string str the second line contains an integer and the output format is the print the resultant string right and then constraints are given here so here is the sample input that is talk mat and the kth value is 2 and the output is tomcat right so how is this output coming let me explain that so at first look at the pattern they have given this is not used as usual right it is uh, there is different in uh, order so let's look at the input that is the first two characters should be sorted in increasing order right so look at the position of them so t here and o is here so they are already in an increasing order so we should not uh, modify them uh, let let them as it is and the next two elements that is cm uh, we have to sort them by decreasing order right so look at their position that is c and m here right so they are sorted right now so we have to uh, sort them by decreasing order so we have to write m first then c comes right so we have to change their position by swapping right so mc right so the output will be tomcat okay let's look at the second input right let me paste the pattern here look at here so the input is madam right and the k value is 2 so we have to sort the first k element by increasing increasing order right so look at their position a is here and m is here so uh, and m is present at the first so we have to arrange them by increasing order i mean we have to sort them right so a should be at the first position and m at the last so a m a r a and m is sorted then the next k element that is two element d a the, uh, d is here and a is here they are already in a decreasing order right uh, sorted by decreasing order so we should not change their position so the output is amdam okay so i hope you have got the logic now let's solve the code so before we proceed to the solution i would request you to please pause the video and try to solve the problem by yourself and give me the code in the comment section right so that it will enhance your problem solving ability and Please watch the playlist regarding Accenture on campus coding questions that are being solved in this channel. Please uh, go through the link that is given in the description box, right? And please subscribe this channel. Let me write the code a little, then I will explain, right? String S and K as argument. Then pattern is equal to this and sorted part is equal to dot join sorted s is to k right and key is equal to lambda x and return pattern dot index right index of x i am explaining whatever i am writing right 
just have a patience whatever i have written in this line let me explain that the sorted part variable stores the first key characters of the string s arranged in increasing order and the sorted function is used here with a custom sorting key provided using lambda function and the pattern dot index x returns the index of character x in the pattern string which is used for sorting and i hope you have knowledge about lambda function this is the argument of lambda function and this is the returning statement of lambda function right so in this similar way we will take another variable that is reversed part reversed part is equal to this right so sorted but in this case the only difference will be here and another i am telling why where so k is 2 that means the next k element right the next k element and here there will be a, a reverse is equal to true statement right after print after index x right reverse is equal to true right okay now so we will go to the next line that is we will take another variable remaining part is equal to s to multiply k is to actually you should have knowledge about slicing here right so result variable store this sorted i'm explaining whatever i am doing here right sorted array plus reversed array and the remaining part right and return the result after all are done right okay let me explain whatever i have written in these three lines actually the reverse part variable stores the next uh, k characters of the string s arranged in decreasing order similarly as uh, the sorted part right it uses the sorted uh, function which with a custom sorting key and the reverse is equal to true here which is uh, the argument to sort in decreasing order right and here the remaining part variable stores the remaining characters of the string s after the first two k character two multiply k characters right and then the result uh, variable is constructed by concatenating sorted part reversed part and remaining part after that we are returning the result right so let's read the input from the user so at first the string right string input and then the k element that is int input right okay I'll just print the function right so print arrange string stk right so i hope this code is okay just run the code okay, so, so first input was tomcat sorry tomcat talk mat and k is 2 so the output is tomcat and it is expected output right and let's run the second input that is madam and 2 so amdm right so i hope you have got the logic in this code so i hope you have loved this session so if you want more such videos then please subscribe this channel and be with us thank you for today's session